Hi, in this lesson I'm going to teach you some of the English words that came from Arabic origins and I will show you the difference with the Arabic word and in the English word and you will see that um, there are similarities between the two languages. Um, uh, these words that English uses that have Arabic origins are called loan words, the words that English loaned took um, uh, from Arabic language and they are used nowadays so I took you know the most important ones or the most um, um, used ones and I'm going to show you them and I'm going to show you the Arabic origin in transcription and also in Arabic characters these are the same words that we use in Arabic language so let's begin um, have you known that the word alcohol comes from alcohol in Arabic kuhul or alcohol this is the origin of the word alcohol hmm? Oh, Al-Jabra, it comes from the word Al-Jabr, Al-Jabr in Arabic, Al-Jabr, Al-Jabra in English. Alright, now the word Apricot, it comes from the word Al-Barqoq in Arabic, Al-Barqoq. <laughs> and the word Aubergine, this, this is new to me, I didn't know that Aubergine came from al Badinjan. So in Arabic, Aubergine or eggplants are called Badinjan, Badinjan. And I studied this, and it comes from Beth and Jan, so Aubergine has Arabic um, origin. All right, um, let's see the next one. Coffee! <laughs> coffee, not only the word, which is Qahwa, Qahwa, but also Arabs brought, the, you know, created the coffee, I think so. <gasps> I hope I'm not mistaken. I, no, I think, I think Arabs created, created, found the coffee um, uh, at the beginning, I don't know. I hope I'm not uh, wrong. All right. So, coffee in Arabic is qahwa, qahwa. And this is why it's called coffee. And then we have cotton. Cotton in Arabic is qutun, qutun with the ta, the lateral ta. Qutun, qutun. So, it's, this is the uh, origin. Oh, giraffe. Did you know that giraffe uh, comes from zarafa in Arabic? Zarafa, giraffe. Also in Italian, giraffa. Hmm. Hashish. <laughs> hashish now it's used as cannabis in English language, but hashish in Arabic means grass. So the normal grass of my garden is called hashish. And this is why um, the English word is hashish. Because we, we in English we don't have the h sound, we have the h. Ha, hashish. Okay, then we have lilac. It comes from lilac in Arabic. Lilac. And then lime comes from laymoon in Arabic or layma. Layma. Mafia is an Arabic word. I know that mafia came through out Italian to English language. So this is also a loan word that is not direct, but it's indirect Arabic to Italian to English. Mafia. So, oh, monsoon. I, I learned that in Thailand. I didn't know that monsoon came, came from the word mausim, mausim in Arabic, and it means season. Monsoon, season, mausim, mausim. Um, let's see, sofa, sofa comes from the word sofa in Arabic, sofa, sugar, it comes from sukkar, sukkar, also zucchero in Italian comes from Arabic, sukkar, all right, these were some of the words that come from uh, Arabic origins, I don't know if you were aware of these before, but I showed you, I tried to show you also, also the Arabic transcription, um, the Arabic, uh, in Arabic uh, characters, the words that we use. I hope it was um, helpful. I hope you're surprised, just like I was surprised with aubergine. <laughs> it comes from Benjan. All right. So I hope you enjoyed this lesson. I hope I was useful in this lesson. And um, just know that sukkar, uh, sugar comes from sukkar, and etc. Cotton comes from kutun. Um, apricot comes from barqoq and etc. Right? So I hope you liked it and I will see you in the next time. Uh, take care of yourself and stay tuned. Ma salama!